Last week, the anti-Islamic Q Society held fundraising dinners featuring cartoonist Larry Pickering, no relation, and <laughs> political commentator Ross Cameron, no relation, and Senator Cory Bernardi, my dad. Conservative Senator Cory Bernardi has denied any wrongdoing after attending a hotly protested anti-halal function in Melbourne last night. There was a similar function in Sydney on Thursday where political cartoonist Larry Pickering made a series of stunning anti-Muslim and homophobic comments. Larry Pickering reportedly joked to the audience that Muslims weren't all bad because sometimes they threw gay people off buildings. The comments that were made there, I have to say, no matter how much I celebrate freedom of speech, they were absolutely out of line. When Cory Bernardi says you're out of line, you must be ripping into some opinions that are so extreme, you make Pauline Hanson go, come on, that's a bit much. <laughs> Even the uncompromising Ross Cameron felt the need to explain himself on Sky News. I want, in relation to comics and to joke makers... Larry Pickering's not a comic, is he? Well, he's, he's, he's a... He's, he's a, a really he, offensive man. Well, he's a comic artist. That's, that's what he does. That was an attempt at a joke. I think it was an attempted gag. It was an after... It were, all of us were giving an after-dinner speech. Our job was to entertain the crowd. For more on this, I'm joined by after-dinner speaker extraordinaire Tom Gleeson. Yes. Good <laughs> um, So, pretty... Pretty fruity stuff. Yeah, I actually went to the Q Society dinner, Charlie. What? what why would you go to that? <laughs> well, I wanted to get some material. <laughs> There was some pretty funny stuff there. What, funny stuff? What, what are you talking about? Hang on, let's, let's go through this, OK? Right. Ross... We'll, we'll go through it bit by bit. OK, bit by bit. Ross Cameron was first. He said, and I quote, the New South Wales division of the Liberal Party is basically a gay club. Classic. <laughs> I don't mind that they're gay. I just wish, like Hadrian, they would build a wall. I don't even get that, but it's good. <laughs> Uh, and then he referred to the journalists in the room uh, saying that they were from the Sydney Morning Homosexual. Yeah. Stop being so PC, Charlie. <laughs> you can have a Morning Homosexual in Sydney. It's 2017, mate. Oh. Relax. All right, well, let's, let's, uh, let's have a look. I mean, surely you can't defend Larry Pickering. No relation. Uh, <laughs> who said, let's be honest, I can't stand Muslims. Classic. If they are in the same street as me, I start shaking. I don't get it, but it's good. <laughs> They're not all bad. They do chuck pillow biters off buildings. Yeah, I, uh, I don't know about that one, to be fair. I... But are they really jokes, Tom? Well, it, it doesn't matter what you or I think, Charlie. It doesn't matter. That's why I took those jokes down to my local comedy club... <laughs> ..and I let the audience decide. Yes, hello! How are you, Comics Lounge? You good? Yes, are there any Muslims in tonight? Any? No, nah, it's probably a good thing, OK? Well, let's be honest, I cannot stand Muslims. I can't. I can't. When I see them in the same street, I start... I start shivering. I do. Oh, well, they're not all bad. You know, they, they do chuck their pillow biters off buildings. <laughs> all right, OK, I lost you there. Um... Well, you've been eating too much halal food, have you? <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll try something else. Let's see if this win you, wins you back. Here we go. <clears throat> the New South Wales Division of the Liberal Party <laughs> are basically a gay club. I mean, I don't mind that they're gay. I just wish, like Hadrian, they would, you know, build a wall. <laughs> no, I feel like I'm losing you. Um, What's wrong with you? No Hadrian fans in tonight? No, no. All right, this is going to get a shit review in the Sydney Morning Homosexual, that's for sure. I can't believe you actually did that. Like, you went and died. Yeah, on my hole. Yeah, that was terrible. Yeah, I know. I went down awful. there and I did their jokes and, and didn't get many laughs because it turns out the silent majority is a bit too silent. <laughs> Yeah, or maybe, maybe... Uh, let me ask you this, Tom. If the silent majority is so silent that nobody can hear them, are they a majority at all? <laughs> no. <laughs>